So this story, this one, is about the time that, you know, I deserved a prom date and I didn't get one and I'm still mad about it. I'm really angry and I know everyone wanted this slice of pie and they didn't get it because they never asked and I try asking them and then they always feel like no and anyways. So basically, I'm homeschooled, right? <laughs> Hello, fellow friends. This is a time when I was 15 and I went to a homeschool prom. And I don't know if you know so much about the homeschool community, but we have prom, but a lot of us know each other. Like, we are not always super lonely. Like, we, like, homeschool kids join clubs and things and do extracurricular activities together to count as their extracurricular activities for college and stuff. So, a lot of these kids knew each other and we set up prom. We set it up prom, you know, things were good, things were dandy. But months before, I was looking for a date for prom. And I played soccer, so I was like, maybe one of the boys on the soccer team wanted me. I knew people at the time, I was in clubs, you know. I, I knew people from like everywhere in life, you know. So I was like, I could, I'm, I'm gonna, you know, try asking people. So I messaged so many people including like a local college football player and that wasn't a good idea because like I, I saw that he was like I think 21 but I was like you know like the age limit to bring people was 21 I was like I'm just gonna ask as many people as I can and I don't care um so I asked him and he responded he was like no and I was like but I'm a fan <laughs> and then he's like no and then I was like Okay, and I tried asking him again the next year. He still said no, but um, this is where everything starts getting manic. So I asked that dude, you know, I didn't think he was going to say yes anyways, more or less a joke, but you know, just to see. And um, I actually asked like kind of everyone I knew, like, or at least inadvertently asked them like, oh, are you going to prom? You know, would you, if you, you know, I'm not, I'm, I don't have a date either, you know, but they were always like, nah, I don't want to do that with you or whatever. And I thought my one friend was going to ask me, but because like we were friends, you know, and he didn't, he asked a different girl and I know he's regretting that decision now. And, um, you know, it's just one of those things. It's just one of those things should have known better should have known better <laughs> it is what it is so i was asking people for a long time everyone said no and then it became the day before prom where we were setting up for prom like at the venue because i was in the club that helped set up for that too and you know i was seeing and talking to everyone and i was like oh do you have a date do you have a date? And then this one guy asked me like, oh, hey, Lauren, do you have a date? And I was like, no, do you? And then he was like, yeah, her name's, and I was like, like it kind of catfished me, but like, yeah, no one went with me that year. And when I walked in, I was wearing this beautiful pink dress. Here's the pictures. I was wearing this beautiful pink dress and I knew I looked good because at the time I had blonde hair and I had like literally the blondest hair and I knew people knew I looked good and I knew they were staring at me right but like um I was just so sad I didn't have a date I actually left early and went home and got in trouble and I didn't get to go to my friend's house because I was at least looking forward to getting to go to my friend's house you know, like after going to prom and being really disappointed because I thought it was going to be like Disney Channel. I thought everyone was going to dance like this and, you know, and but it wasn't like that. It was all a lie in my opinion. Um, but I'm going to go back again this year and I'm going to vlog that too and vlog? I don't like that. I'm going to record everything. I'm going to record it and don't question what's on my hands. I'm going to record it and you're going to like it. Hopefully. I hope you do. You actually know you are.
but like Sometimes that happens like I, I hear guys talk about that type of thing happening to them But it does happen to girls too and you just don't see because it was literally like me left in the shadows It was like so many people didn't know so many people didn't know how much that like really hurt my confidence how many people didn't like me like But I mean I'm, I'm You know <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this video. It was fun for me to make. Um, you see my relay, that's me. <laughs> um, I hope you enjoyed this video because I know I did making it. And please like, subscribe, and follow my socials down below, AK Local. Um, yeah. Peace.